everyone. Welcome to another RH Crew reaction video. I'm Shorty P. I'm Duke. Today we're going to be reacting to Naruto episode 23. So last time we uh, got to meet Rock Lee. We did. We got to meet Rock. We yes, yes. And uh, his sensei, Might Guy. <laughs> and a turtle. And a turtle, which may or may not be sensei. <laughs> <laughs> can turtles be sensei too? I mean, yes. I think they can. I mean, uh, it's according to other anime. According to Master Roshi. Yeah. And, the Turtle uh, Man. And Turtle. Yeah. Yeah. I think I'm going to like both those characters just because, like, I loved Mr. Saiyan Man. Like, or, I liked the great Saiyan Man. I liked Mr. Satan. I like all the over-the-top characters. Uh, okay, yeah. Even the Ginyu Force. I like all the over-the-top over cringy shit because I'm a dad. We've got uh, Sasuke, who's just, like, excited, but excited because he thinks he might actually get beat. Right. I think. He's got some good competition. Right. Um, Naruto showing some weird wisdom and coolness. Like, yeah. Just saying he trains harder than you. He's like, facts, right? Yeah. Can't wait to see what happens next. Yeah, same here. Uh, so hopefully this episode we get to the tuning exam. We've been talking about it for a little bit. So we'll see. Maybe. Yeah. yeah it is. It is anime. <laughs> right. You yeah. never know where it's going to go. Six episodes later. Oh, yeah. Well, in the tuning test, I'm going to kick your ass. Ten episodes later. Uh, we're starting the tuning test. So this is going to be interesting. Yeah. All right, everybody, please subscribe. Hit the like button. Leave a comment. Let us know what you thought about the episode and our reaction to it. Also, hit that notification bell that we stay up to date with all of our uploads. If you like what we do and you want to support us and get early access to our reactions as well as reactions without the overlay, head over to patreon.com slash rh crew do it all right let's see where we're at glad you came sakura for your sake and uh, the other. if anybody's kakashi, kakashi sensei knows he's like yeah you're gonna need her <laughs> uh if anybody's wondering we're not gonna use uh subs because sometimes they give spoilers like oh, if there's like okay. a character you're not supposed to know who it is yet sometimes in the subs it says their name when it when it reads the line oh, okay. so no, okay. so I know it's easier for reactions because you can kind of read along, and because we got to keep the audio down a little bit. But for that reason alone, we're not going to do it. Right on. Huh? Unless enough of now, you, you ask us to do otherwise, register for the tuning and exam. then we'll just play it by ear. Why? What do you mean? You see, only groups of three are allowed to apply for and take the exam. But Sensei, you said the decision to take the exam was up to the individual. Mm -hmm. That's right. Was that a lie? No. Sort of. Not really. It is an individual decision, but it affects all of you. Mm -hmm. I didn't tell you before because I didn't want the other guys pressuring you. <laughs> At the same time, I didn't want you feeling obliged to participate because of any feelings you might have for Sasuke. I wanted you to come to a decision of your own free will. Do you mean if the others had shown up but I decided not to come with them? It would have been the end of the line. I couldn't have let the others in. You're all here and for the right reasons. Sakura. <laughs> Naruto. <laughs> and Sasuke. I'm proud of you. What? I couldn't ask for a better team. Aw, chef. Good luck. We won't let you down, Sensei. Believe it. Good music. Yeah, always. <laughs> I had no idea there'd be so much competition. Some of them look grown as hell. Yeah. If being scary looking is one of the tests, they've got me beat. Sasuke, where have you been? <laughs> oh my. Boy, you have no idea how much I was hoping you'd show up here. Hey, you porker! Don't touch it. It's expensive. Put it down. She called her a porker. <laughs> really? A porker? Yeah. It's you guys. I knew this was going to be a drag. So all three stooges are here. <laughs> hey, you know what, Pipsqueak? You're scared. Always complaining, never does anything about it. It's worth saying that's Munkin's favorite character. Is it really? Yeah. Okay. Munchies more like it. I think he is all right he could. Sorry, but Sasuke's all mine. Ino Yamanaka. 
Now she's annoying. And what? not just because she's got the same stupid thing for Sasuke that Sakura's got. Well, well, what do you know? Where, it where, looks like where? the whole gang's back together again. Hi, Naruto. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Hinata Hyuga. She's okay, but I don't know why she gets all shy and embarrassed every time I even, like, look at her. She wants it. Kiba Inuzuka and his dog Akamaru. Forget what I said about Ino. This guy's the most annoying of all. <laughs> he thinks he's so cool. Does have a cool dog. Then there's Shino Aburame. Well, he's just weird. Kind of a mystery. But that doesn't mean he isn't annoying, too. They wear sunglasses indoors. Yep, here we all are. The nine rookies. <laughs> this is going to be fun for those of us good enough to make the cut. Kiba, careful you don't get overconfident. Just wait. We're gonna blow you guys away. We've been training like crazy. You. What do you Where? think we've been doing? <laughs> Sitting around picking daisies? You don't know what training means. Uh, don't mind Kiba. I'm sure he didn't really mean anything by it. Huh? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> huh? You say something back here? Huh? Huh? Kamado's looking plumper. Plumper. Ooh. What do you want? What's wrong? Thought maybe you hadn't seen it. Huh? Don't kill the Didn't bug. Didn't want you stepping on it. Why? You saving it for lunch? <laughs> <laughs> Is that a horse? Hey, you guys. You might want to try keeping it down a little. I mean, no offense, but you're the nine rookies, right? Fresh out of the academy? I wouldn't go making a spectacle of yourselves. Well, who asked you? Who are you? I'm Kabuto Yakushi. Look around you. <gasps> You've made quite an impression. Everybody's like, can't wait to fuck up these kids. Ah, look, children. Time to kick ass. They're from the rain village. Very touchy. They all are. This exam makes everyone tense, and you don't want to rub them the wrong way right now. Uh-uh. I mean, how could you know how things work? You're just rookies. Kabuto, is that your name? Yeah. She remembers everything. This isn't the first time you've taken the exam? No, it's my seventh. Whoa. Huh? <laughs> well, they're held twice a year, so this will be my fourth year. You must really be an expert by now. Cool, you can give us all the inside tips. Nope, yeah, I'm a shinobi. You get nothing. <laughs> right. Well, seventh time's the charm. That's what they say, huh? So I guess all of those rumors about the exam being tough are true. I knew this was going to be a drag. <laughs> Hang on. Don't give up hope yet. Maybe I can help you kids out a little. With my Dragon Ball Ninja cards? Info cards, Ninja Info what the heck cards. Are those? These cards have been chakra encoded with everything I've learned over the past four years. I've got more than two hundred of them. So you see, I haven't been completely wasting my time. They may not look like much to the naked eye. They appear blank. Don't want just anyone seeing this stuff. What are you doing? You see, I'm using my chakra. To and I'm pulling what's sports. called a pro gamer move. Like this, this is what this example. looks like to me. Yu Gi Oh! Awesome, a map of what? It shows the geographical distribution of all the candidates who have come to take the Chunin exam. What villages they come from and how Game many from each there, village. From their village. Mm -hmm. Why do you guys think they all come here to take the exam together at the same time? Oh, but he hungry. I like this kid. I like him. It's to foster friendship between nations, of course. International brotherhood and all that, and it's true enough as far as it goes. But there's another reason. The important thing is that this way they can carefully regulate the total number of shinobi that end up in each village, maintaining the balance of power. Oh yeah, balance of power. You didn't balance like that. Balance of power, big deal, it's all a drag. Do those cards of yours have any info on the other candidates? You have someone special in mind? I might. Well, I can't promise my information is complete or perfect. But I've got something on just about everyone, including you guys, of course. Dun, dun, dun. So which one is it? Tell me anything you know about them, a description, where they're from, whatever. The music He's notes people only the said desert. three. And there's Rock Lee of the Leaf Village while you're at it. Man, that's no fun. You even know their names. That makes it easy. Show them to me. Hmm. Take them on out. <laughs> Show them to me. That's all I can think of. Mm -hmm. I haven't a clue what's going on here. That's 90% of Lee. life. Mm, more or less. This guy Looks could be like fucking handy to have around. Than you guys. 
Mission experience 11 C ranks and 20 D ranks. Okay. His squad leader is Guy. In the last 12 months, his Taijutsu has radically improved, but his other skills are pretty shaky. Last year, he got a lot of attention as a Geni, but for some reason, he chose not to participate in the Chunin exam. This will be his first time as a candidate, same as you guys. His teammates are Ten Ten and Neji Hyuga. Looks like a relative. Huh? Hyuga? Okay, now for Gara of the Desert. Mission experience, eight C ranks, and Ooh, one B. get this, one B rank is a Genin. He was a rookie from another land originally, but there is this. He survived every mission without getting a scratch on him. The dude's done a B rank as a Genin and has never even been injured? What's the deal with this guy? He's grown. <laughs> I say, it might lead you to believe that he's on a completely different level. Mm-hmm. Leaf, sand, rain, grass, waterfall, sound. They've all sent exceptionally skilled candidates to the exam this time around. Of course, the hidden sound village is small. It sprang up recently. No one knows anything about it. Those guys are a mystery. They look cool. The competition's going to be intense this year. So it would seem it's almost enough to make you lose your confidence. It's a fine time to start talking like that. Do you... Really think it's going to be tougher this time? In the four years I've been coming, I've never seen a crop of candidates with as much potential as this bunch. Hmm. I can't go along with this. They may be under your care now, Kakashi, but I know these kids. They were my students. I trained them. I don't know what you're trying you to know, prove with this, he but... You know, may be right, Kakashi. You're putting a lot of pressure on them. Why so impatient? I held my team back for a year so they could hone their skills and mature. Your concern is touching. You sure it's not just because you know your guys don't stand a chance against mine? Mm. All right, all right, that's enough. The matter of the rookie's participation is closed. I know what I'm doing. You'll see. I wish I was as sure as I sounded. <laughs> I wonder how they're doing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and most of these guys are older and more experienced than we are. It's okay to be a little scared. I can handle it. But it'd be a whole lot easier if I didn't have to watch Naruto falling apart right in front of me. Nothing usually gets to him. Maybe I can try to cheer him up. Hey, don't worry, Naruto. We'll be fine. He's gonna call them all out. <laughs> My name is Naruto Uzumaki, and I'm gonna beat every one of you. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> What's that idiot trying to do? Get us killed? Yes. I should have known. He's not smart enough to be scared. Tell your boyfriend to keep his big fat trap. She said, tell your boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> he lacks that spirit though yeah that's a big ass nose yes son. it is that's a, that's a big old naughty nose and that's the same kid as before isn't it what a jerk well he sure hasn't lost any of his spunk he has passion you heard what he said about the hidden sound village i heard i say we teach this guy some manners yeah time to clear up some of the mystery for him Update his information. Let him know that if you insult the sound shinobi, you better be ready for the consequences. He's got an eye covered. Indeed he does. Uh, can you say that again a little louder? Didn't quite catch it. You moron. Are you trying to get everybody in the place to hate our guts or yep. what? <laughs> <laughs> she called him a jackass. <laughs> Him. And sometimes he says these spazzy things. He doesn't really mean them. They just kind of come out. Now see what you've done, Naruto. You've hurt everybody's feelings. They think you don't respect them, but that isn't true, is it, Naruto? You ready? Let's do it. Huh? Still in everybody's wallets.
They're from the village hidden in the sound. Man, he's fast! He's almost as quick as me. <gasps> oh. Oh, I get it. So it was that kind of attack. Hang on, I saw it all. He dodged the attack. It must have come closer than it looked. Kh, look at him acting like it was nothing. Real tough guy. <gasps> What did he just? Is it like a sound wave attack or something? <coughs> Somebody's always got to be the sacrificial Kabuto, lamb. Are you okay? Not such a tough guy after all, I guess. Maybe that's why he's on his seventh try. Write this on your little card, punk. The Ganyan from the Sound Village will be tuning when this is over. Hey, Lee, what was going on with that attack? There was more to it than just speed. Some kind of trick. All right, you baby-faced degenerates. Pipe down and listen up. It's time to begin. I'm Ibiki Marino, your proctor, your worst enemy. Dun, dun, dun. I'm so glad I'm going to watch another episode, dude. <laughs> I, I would have been so pissed off. <laughs> Leaving right there. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I'm so glad. Dude, that was a great episode. So yeah. we're getting a little bit more knowledge. We're seeing some things um, kind of develop and unfold. To me, this was just like a setup mm -hmm. so that we clearly understand what's, what's going to happen. Yeah, they're kind of letting you know, like, these are the people you need to pay attention to in this arc. Right. They're keeping Gara a complete mystery. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> even that card wasn't even like, oh, here's his ninjutsu, his taijutsu, his genjutsu. It's like, we ain't no shit was about shit with like, this guy. But He was a candidate someplace else, but we don't know where. <laughs> they didn't say where. Obviously, he doesn't look like the other people from the village. That should be interesting. Maybe he has, he's able to tie in two villages' teachings. Maybe. So, Maybe. I don't know. That's immediately what I thought whenever I heard that. I was like, oh, yeah, he's, he's probably going to have access to two villages jutsus and maybe even some forbidden shit that the other villages, you know, like, I don't know. Who knows? I see him as a legitimate threat badass, especially if Sasuke is like, whoa, and <laughs> right. this dude snuck up on Sasuke. And so. he's been on a B rank mission. Right. And not and even injured. Yes. Didn't get a scratch. Yeah. It's insane. Kabuto is kind of like our narrator. Yeah. You know, like, yeah. Uh, here's what's going on. You know? Yep. I'll tell you all the stuff that was written in the book that, <laughs> that didn't transfer over to the movie. Yeah. Basically, that type of thing. More or less. I'm excited for this. This is going to be sick, I yeah. think. The sound didn't just seem pretty cool. Yeah. He swung and he missed, but there was damage. And maybe there's some sort of, to their attacks, there's sound waves attached to it behind. Yeah. behind. That's, what I, that's immediately what I thought. That was what I thought, too, the first time I watched it. It was so. like sound village, invisible looking attack. Yeah. It kind of makes sense. Right. Right. He so. was moving around all over the damn place. Like I said, like still in everybody's wallet. <laughs> right. Five finger discount jutsu. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Just the village that does the one hand side. <laughs> right. Five finger. This was fun. I can't wait for the next one, man. Well, shit. Let's head over to it. All right, everybody. Thank you for uh, being here. Please subscribe. Leave a like. Leave a comment. Let us know what you thought about the episode and our reaction to it. Hit the notification bell. That way you stay up to date with all of our uploads. And then head over to patreon.com slash rhcrew. Subscribe there. Get early access to our reactions as well as uh, clean versions without the overlay. And uh, we'll see you next time.